the reverse gear. You can see by when the camera comes on. When you park, you push this one in like that. That's it. Handbrakes are automatic, so you don't oh. need to worry about handbrake. Okay. So what you do is, after you've positioned yourself properly, all you've got to do is put it into the drive. You see the gear engage into drive. It's the first gear. The gear B1. will change by yourself. You don't have to worry about it anymore. But if you're out there driving and you accidentally touch it, right, it'll go into neutral only, and you just push the gear down straight into drive. It won't break the car. Mm. Okay. So when we when we and I'll show you right, when you get closer to objects, right. For example, just say this car in front of us, right, mm -hmm. in the car. Just say, pretend we're in the car park. What happens is as you get closer to the car. The first thing you'll do is the cameras will come on so as soon as you get closer to an object this is your parking sensors around here okay that's just to show you a quick picture now if you want to see the full picture you push down it'll come up but in this case right just say i'm going to keep going this way when this thing is red you stop ah. so this is the parking sensor and then that's the back and the cameras will come on automatically when you get too close to something when you engage reverse the whole camera will come on the tire track will move, so this is what we call it, the tire track. It moves with your steering wheel, okay? Now, for example, I put it into drive. Now it's showing us in the front. So, how do I want to make sure I don't hit that car? Right now, I'm going to hit that car. If I turn that, right, no. and I just let go, I will okay. clear that car. Yeah. So, correct. Too. Now, for example, this bit here, right? So, in the front of us. I go here and I go, okay, I want to make sure I don't hit that van. Okay. Okay, I'm good. Oh, so you can okay. slowly, slowly go and make sure you watch yourself, yeah? Mm. If I keep holding easy, it clears the car perfectly. Yeah, yeah. So that's how you use the cameras. So yeah. in this, right, for example, if you want to know you can fit through, as long as the line can put you through, you mm -hmm. just go. I don't even look at the back or the front anymore. I actually use the camera. It's really camera bad. Only. It's really bad. Now, if I want to make sure I want to get out of here, same thing again. You can see it'll just hit that chair. So I know I'll need to do a three-point turn of some sort. I come here. I put it into reverse. I just make sure they're back. I'm not even looking back. I'm just using my mirrors. And this is picking up this van next to us. Okay? So as Scotty coming close to us, this will warn, warn us as well as someone's coming. Okay. So if I back out just then, the car will actually break and then hit, 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 hit the warning for us. Now, I go here. Yeah, I'm perfect. So uh, I the, just do this. The car automatically breaks. Uh, if, you, if you keep going and there's a beep, it'll beep at you. Mm -hmm. And then just before you hit, it'll break for you. Break for me. Correct, correct. Mm -hmm. Now, but please don't rely on that. You need to stop. Sometimes these systems do do, yeah. do not not 100% can do it, okay? So these self-braking features, please don't rely on it. It is there to help you, but you still need to brake yourself, okay? Yeah. So be very, very careful there. So what we do is, right, as we're driving through here, you can almost just use the camera to make sure. So if I want to park, for example, right, just say I want to park the car into this spot. Okay. So if I do this, that means I'm going to end up there. So it's not that good. So I'm going to reverse a little bit. Then I put it into drive, right? And then I'm gonna point myself into there. Yep, that's looking good. So then I'm gonna go, then I'll use my eyes because the guide will give me a very general guide. And then when you get close up, what you do is, right? I typically put the red line touching the object. That's it. And when you walk out the front, you have just enough space in the front. So the red line is the advice of where you stop. Mm -hmm. So you don't want that red line to touch something. Same as when you're reversing. So if, if for example, if I'm reversing to the back now, I just keep going, 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 and, I, and, I, and I'll use the guide and I'll use my parking sensor as I'm getting closer now. Four wheel drive is different because they're higher. So I will stop at about now. This will be the maximum I will go. Mm. You see, and also this will flash in red. So okay. when you flash in red, you don't want to go anymore. Okay, so that's the main thing that you got to look for with this parking system. So then over here, I'll hand it over to you, then and then you, you take over, and I'll take you around the back streets, which is not as busy. If the camera stays on until 15 kilometers per hour, 1.5, and then it will disappear automatically. So I'll change driver with you up here, Mary. I've set your setting from the from this particular position, right? So if I move my seat, so just say this is my position now, right? Because you were here last time, so I saved the actual position for you. So what happens is now I'll swap drivers with you. So what you're gonna do is right when you jump over, so first thing is you push the park there, 
then the handbrake is actually down here if you want to manually do it but you mm. don't have to do it no, the car know. will automatically do it for you now when you're sitting here if you want to go back to your position i've saved you as one yeah you push okay. and hold it now the steering wheel is moving the seat is moving now so this is what you had at the last time mm -hmm. okay and then you can keep making changes to it now just say when you're driving later you move the seat back you move this you lower yourself or up yourself whatever that you do you need to reset the memory by pushing and pushing one again but when you go back you just push and hold the one okay so that's how you set up all your different positions mm -hmm. now let's swap seats as soon as you open the door so when you're in park already yeah mary you open the door you see the handbrake my, my automatically applies for you mm -hmm. so you will never let you get out of the car without the handbrake on automatic and correct Dan correct correct automatic. correct okay just in case you forget all right let's swap so after you're done push m push one And then, are you happy with that side? Yeah. Then you leave it, right? Then you push M, M push one. Push, push one. one. You hear the dud. So that's your position now. For them, for correct, everything, correct, for, for everything. everything. So just say you're driving later or, or, or on the way home okay. um, tomorrow, you make some more adjustment. Make sure whatever adjustment you do, you push M, push one again. Push Otherwise, it won't, it won't reset, as in it'll just go into the previous one. Okay. okay. Now, let's, let's put the car into gear, Mary. Foot on the brake, put it into drive. That's it. Down. Down. Yeah. And then the handbrake. See the handbrake is still on because yeah. we haven't engaged the, the disengaged the, the handbrake yet. Now this you need to manually do it. Foot on the brake still, Mary, please. Down there, there's a little P. Can you see it? Where my where the end of the pen is? There's a little P. Yep. Flick it out. Out? Out. That's it. That will release it. Push it in, the same button, please. That is to apply it. Okay? So that's your manual. So, but you don't manually, have to do it. Yeah, correct, yeah, correct, yeah. correct. It's correct, the manual correct, correct. Now, push yeah, in. It out, put it yeah. into on, flick out to release. No, no, say it again. Uh, yeah, push, push in. out. Uh, yeah, push. flick out, sorry, flick out. Flick out. Perfect, let's go. Yep. Yeah. Okay. That's do it. Now, that's manual. That's ma that, now it's in manual, but you're in drive already, so we can go. Okay? Let's do it. Okay. Let's do it. Who's the one is not in seatbelt? Uh, uh, she Mary, she yeah. hasn't got her seatbelt on. <laughs> naughty, naughty. Now, when you plug in the seatbelt, Mary, sit back against your seat, okay, for one second. So plug it in, sit back. That's it, perfect. No, 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 you always sit back, okay, because the, the seatbelt will measure yeah. how hard it needs to pull you if it needs to use the, okay. the active seatbelt. Yeah. Blocking the sun. Mm. Wait for Natalie to pass, and then let's go. One thing you have to get used to is the throttle in the car. That one, the throttle, the throttle, the gas pedal, right? So if you want the car to go a bit faster, you do need to put your foot down because it's, it's a nine speed gearbox and it's a fly-by wire throttle. What that means is it's a computer control throttle as in your gas pedal. So if you want more power, you do need to put your foot down a little bit more, okay? In and morale. It's very different, yeah, if you want power. Correct, you see? You see the difference? So don't be afraid to put your foot down, okay? Now, the blinker's on this side, Mary, so don't use that one. That one's your gear, yeah? Let's go left, all right? I'll take you around the back streets here. This is 40 only here. Correct, correct. And it's 40 temporary, so you can do 60 here. Say it again, you cannot do You can do 60 because oh. this is only for schools only. Oh. And then up there is 60. Don't worry, if you're gonna apprehend, Jason will... Uh, yeah, I'll, 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 <laughs> I will tell you to stop. Put your foot down a little bit, Mary. Don't be afraid. Put your foot down a little bit. That's it, that's it. So what, you we do, right? you. what we do, let's keep going straight. I'm gonna get you to turn right at the traffic light, okay? And don't be afraid to put your foot down a little bit more, Mary, if you need more power, okay? Just put your foot Stand down right if you here. want more power. Yes, we follow the lights to go right. Beautiful. You didn't use the gear, which is good. There's the, the red light, so we stop there. When we stop at the lights, Mary, I'll show you something with the brakes, right? So your foot's on the brake right now. Yeah. Okay? Push down. Don't lift, just push down. You see the word hold? Now you can lift up your foot altogether. 
move your foot to the accelerator pedal, all right? When the light turns green, you can just push the accelerator pedal and the car will go. So uh, this is the, 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 the temporary hold for you. Uh, okay. So you don't need to need hold to. your foot on yeah, the brake. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you just, just exactly what you just did. When you come to a standstill, don't lift up your foot, just a quick tap. Uh, you see tap. the word hold come up, yeah. you can let go of the brake mm -hmm. and move. Now move your That's foot good. to the accelerator pedal because it's about to turn green. So put your foot to the accelerator pedal. When the light to. turns green, yeah, put your foot to the yep. accelerator pedal. That's it. You don't need to go. touch the brake again. Put your foot down and off she goes. That's it. Beautiful. Let's follow this through, okay? Please watch the curbs when you drive because the wheels are very, very big. You can curb the wheels, so be very, very slow at the start. Now put your foot down on the straight line. Yep, we keep going straight. Now what we do, we turn right here. So put your blinkers on, Mary. That's it, we follow this car in front now. On St. Kilda Road, there's two parts, okay? We're gonna go to the inner one, okay? So we're not gonna go to the far left, we're gonna go to the inner one where the tram is. As we go, I'll show you where to go. I'm not used to driving in the city, you know. Oh, of course, of course. Not many people yeah. used to this, okay? Yeah. So it's okay. I will guide you. Yep, we follow this car in front of us. Give way to the pedestrian. Yeah, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. We follow into the inside. Yeah. Don't follow this car. Yep, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. Yep, we follow this. Wait for the, pe the pedestrian and then let's go inside here. Inside that's here? That's it, that's it. Oh, Beautiful. Yeah. Inside. That's it. Don't follow him. We go inside here. Beautiful. Let's go. Volentao. Isn't that Shrine of Remembrance? Correct. Mm -hmm. So around here is very, very busy, but it gives you an idea of the comfort of the car. Mm -hmm. Then when you get back to your area, when you pick it up, then you can, you know, do a lot more because you're more used to the road. And I'm going to get you to do a U-turn up here, Mary, so stick to the right line. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stick we to keep the right going, line. keep going, but we're going to go to the right first, okay? So don't follow straight through, we're gonna to go to the right. The right. Yep, that's it. We'll put the blinkers on. Beautiful. Now we go here. So here, what this I'm gonna right. get correct, correct. What I'm gonna get you to do, I'm gonna get you to go through that gap over there. Okay? But Which? check check this gap right here. Do a U-turn. Okay. Yep. Make sure there's no tram behind you. you. Yes. But you gotta go turn. into the far right lane, okay? Far yep. Line. Yep. That's it. Beautiful, beautiful. What is the kitted? Uh, sometimes it picks up leaves or, or, or the side mm -hmm. um, thing. It'll, it'll beep, but then it will go away. Now put your foot down a little bit, Mary. You're going to get used to picking it up. Yeah, put your foot down on the accelerator pedal. That's it, that's it. You see, the power is actually really good. Okay? <laughs> a lot of the customer actually get scared at the start. Mm -hmm. it's it's too too nine speed we're going to go down here. Okay? Go down here. Watch in the city. You've got to watch your mirror. Make sure no red dots. Then you can turn. Because if there's a bicycle coming, the red dots will come on when they're next to you. Mm. So the blind spot the assist. Red, Correct, red. that's a little red dot there. That's a blind spot assist. Now let's keep going straight through here. I wouldn't take you onto the main road just yet. Back here is much easier for you to get used to the car so you're comfortable. If you don't have cars you know, coming up behind you. Let's go left here, Mary. Now, do you feel the turning is very, very responsive? in the Mercedes. They are very, very responsive. These cars are very good. They are, when you're doing 100 k's on the freeway, that's when you will really notice the difference. Uh, These cars are designed to travel at that sort of speed. So when you when you go home, on your way home, when you actually use the freeway, that's when you will really appreciate the car. Here, it's more for you to get used to how the car goes. Oh, okay. That's it, beautiful. No fast, okay? No fast over the speed hump. Because the bottom is quite low, so yeah. you've got to be careful when you go over the hump. That's it. That's it. So when you pick up Mary, get used to it. And next time when we pick up again, I want you to put your foot down just a little bit more, okay? So after we come off the speed hump, I want you to put your foot down just a little bit more than normal. Yeah, put your foot down a little bit more. Yeah, that's it. Put it more, 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 don't be afraid. That's it, that's it. You need to put your foot down to know the points. Okay? So we keep going straight, Mary. Stay, do we just follow this way? Follow this way. That's it, that's it. We're gonna go through the roundabout now, okay? So you can get a bit of feel of the turning. There's two roundabouts coming up. So we keep going straight. Watch your traffic on the right. You see the steering wheel, it's very yeah, responsive, yeah. okay? It is very different to a mass market car. The steering wheel is very, very responsive. We keep going straight. 
a bugger. Now, I'm going to get you to do a U-turn on these roundabouts. So we're going to come back. We're going to put the blinkers on. And then we're going to come back. Yep, blinkers on. Now we're going to come back, okay? U-turn, okay. So follow these oh, roundabouts. Yeah. Full U-turn. Yeah, yeah. Watch the curb, sorry. Don't turn too much just yet. Beautiful. Go with the road. 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 Beautiful. You got to give way to this pedestrian. <laughs> and then we go. You see, the steering wheel is so responsive, you go with the car. You don't just turn, you go with the car, okay? Now we keep going straight, Mary. I'm gonna get you to turn left here, okay? I'm sorry to make you do all this, but I want you yeah, to feel yeah. how all this, so. yeah. At the next roundabout, we're gonna turn right. 